Cursed. Cursed college bills. Hold on. I'm gonna need to open up something that I'm like, okay, this must be the college bill. Oh, it's a refund bill. Okay. Alright. So you should be expecting a check, so. This is what you want me to. Yeah, see? cool. There's another piece of mail there you might want to take a look at, though. It's from the Social Security Administration, and it's addressed to Justin Brooks, Terry Smith. So, I actually went to the Social Security um, office and actually um, showed them my marriage certificate and wanted my name changed to Justin B. Terry Smith, because that is who I am now. So, and this is from them, so let's see what they have to say. This is a receipt to show that you applied for a social security card on April the 6th, 2010. You should have your card within two weeks. Any document you receive, you have submitted are being returned to you as this receipt. If you have not received your social security card within two weeks, please let us know. You may call, write, or visit any social security office. If you visit an office, please bring us the receipt with you. To protect your privacy, we will not disclose your social security number over the telephone. The social security administration is required by law to limit replacement social security cards to three per year and ten per lifetime. Do not carry your social security card with you. Keep it in a safe location, not in your wallet. The field office manager. So, so what this means is that my name has changed officially. So, <laughs> so now I am legally known as Justin Brooks Terry Smith because that is my name and that is who I'm married to. So, that's it. All you have to do is All you have to do is go to your Social Security office and show them your marriage certificate because that's what I did. And I showed them a couple of bills that I was paying under Justin B. Terry Smith, and that was it. That was it. And. And that was it. <laughs> so, thank you for watching, and thank you for listening. <laughs>